Uh, the deck has plenty of storage, so the forward hatch is uh, for the anchor chain and the anchor windlass. Then we have uh, the, the gas locker for the stove here forward, ventilated, but with an electrical cooking it can also be changed into storage locker or fuel locker or whatever can be used. Those are the lockers. Further aft on this 65 we have a huge sail locker. The sail locker can take all sails, all gears needed for the boat and also as we have on here the option to have it uh, dressed as a crew cabin. So actually you can live on board, you can have this on a, as an additional cabin on the boat. The teak deck on the Swan 65 is in the same superior teak quality as always used on a Swan. Nicely laid, good looking. We have totally flush deck hatches and also you can have a, a, a mooring winch, a pop-up mooring winch for easier mooring, especially in the Mediterranean harbors. The coach roof design of the Swan 65, similar to what we have on the larger sister 78, 98 and 120, has these uh, beautiful wedged uh, corners, uh, windows all around, forward windows, giving plenty of light inside of the boat and also good view from the saloon all around. The boat is equipped with the carbon mast and the V-boom with the normal slab reefing mainsail but also can have a, a roller furling boom like this one. The boat has wide and nice side decks and the jib sheets and all the lines are led on the deck. So there's no struggling with walking around on the deck and getting stuck on these ropes. The transom opens up with a hydraulic bathing platform. There's a, there are stairs for easy access to the water. Inside, of course, we have a large lazarette or a dinghy garage. So here we have a, a dinghy of about three meters with a center console and outboarder. Perfectly fitted inside, it slides up through these, uh, these uh, rollers and then it moves inside a thwart ship. The boat, or the Swan 65, can also be equipped with a hydraulic gangway sitting here beside the, the hatch, which moves out and can be lifted up and down for easy access to, to shore. The cockpit layout of the Swan 65 is with uh, the helmsman position aft, so we have the twin consoles with plenty of space for, for steering the boat. Here, just forward of the pedestals, is kind of the sailing area with all the winches, so everything, the halyards, the sheets, etc., are operated from here. And then forward, we have the, the guest area with the table and with the seats. Uh, so when sailing the boat, actually, the steering is independent from the from the maneuvering and from the guests, uh, making it very comfortable for people on board. Uh. The guest area with the cockpit table is very large, seating a lot of people. Perfect for dinner or enjoying life outboard. Uh, there is a large spray hood. When it's away, it's totally hidden behind the lids, cannot be seen, but still giving a lot of protection when, when sailing the yacht in, in rougher weather.